Hello everybody, it is Westland Rules 101 here. And I'm back with some more Squad Battles rewards. Now, if you had seen last week's episode, um, if not, I don't blame you, we didn't get very much. And also, I had made a great error in messing up the recording. I believe this one's on me. I think I know what I did wrong, so hopefully it's fixed. Um, since I've been now using the Elgato Sound Capture to do my commentary, because I found out that that's actually a more trustworthy way to do it compared to the live commentary, whereas the live commentary, as you, if you've seen other videos, it can be really glitchy randomly, which is stupid, but something you have to deal with, unfortunately. So, this week, hopefully it's working. I'll have to double check. I really need to get on that. I sometimes don't even listen to it because I'm just like, ah, I'll be fine. But got to pay attention. Otherwise, mistakes like that are going to slip through anytime I do that. So I'll try to get better at that. What I'll also try is to get something good this week, despite finishing as a semi-pro 2. Yikes. Now, while our pack value is not as high, that does not mean we're not going to get anything good because... Last week, we got nothing, and we finished Elite 3, and that was the Team of the Year week. So this week, it's all-star players, and I've got two premiums and a base pack. Depending on how these go, I might just buy a pack or two more in the store, get a little bit more content in the video, and maybe hopefully get something good. But base pack number one, let's see. So to probably nobody's surprise, it looks like we're not going to get anything substantial in this. Uh, except for just some stuff that's going to go to my set. Um, okay, so premium pack number one. We might be able to get some good stuff out of one of these. It's definitely not impossible. and. We get a prime time, not the prime time I would have liked. I think there's plenty better prime times, but prime time card. It'll probably go for like 2,000, 3,000 maybe. If not, it doesn't go that way. Who knows? Who cares? Uh, so second premium pack. Oh, we get a coin bonus. Evgeny Dadnov. It appears as though that prime time and this Dadnov is going to be our best pulls. Both 81, unfortunately, which is absolutely phenomenal. Just for curiosity's sake. Okay, we didn't have like any huge 90 overall prime times, at least according to this banner. Although we did get literally one of the weakest ones. Um, no all-star cards. So, of course, so let's quickly hop into that store. And instead of opening two of the premium packs, I think I'll just open up one player's pack. Which is the 10 player items, 5 being gold, and one of them is a guaranteed 80 plus. Here are the odds here, so let's hope that we get one of these all star cards. Actually, is there a better value in any of these ones? So this one, 20k, 10 players, so 10 players, 180 plus, 10 players, 5 gold. So the players' pack's actually technically a better value. So I'm going to go with this. Alright, our first Noah Hannafin. That's our guaranteed 80 plus, and that looks like that's what we're going to get. So, once again, another week... Another week uh, rewards video. I was going to say another week week, but kind of awkward to say and just sounds absolutely horrible um 